Uh, does Jim want on? If Jim comes on, I'll talk to him about the furry business. But, like, I'm... I just want one day, just one day, a single day, where a person that I follow doesn't get the platform. Can we have that? I would have him on. I, I don't care. Like, I I'm not the type of person to hold grudges, really. Uh, I would have Jim on, no problem. It's, it's not even about him, it's like the culture that's really pissing me off. Like, everyone is getting cancelled. And it's not it's not people on the right, by the way. It's not people on the right. University professors, uh, mainstream media, journalists, uh, people that are celebrities, like, predominant leftists. Everyone is getting cancelled right now. Every single person. And over dumb things, it's like, oh, you said this 25 years ago, boom, cancelled. And you don't even know why some of these people get cancelled. Like, there's no explanation. I don't, I don't even know what exactly happened. Um, the only thing I know, like, I'm looking at his previous tweets. Is that he was riding the mayor of Seattle as if she had a saddle. Like, he, he was constantly on her. Like, he was constantly mocking, ridiculing, making fun of her. Uh, you know, her decisions and her politics. And I, maybe like Twitter didn't like that. That's the only explanation that I got. Um, now obviously, you know, people were flagging him and stuff. Especially furries. Like, duh. Uh, and, and I said this. I said this when furries got co-opted by Antifa, which was like three or four years ago. I don't remember when I said it. But I said it like, B you will notice. And I think I said this to Jim as well. You will notice that in the future, people will get fired. Because of pressure from Twitter. And every single time you're going to look at the people who are doing the pressuring. You're going to see one, two or three furries in there. Every single goddamn time. Because <clears throat> the left was utter genius at co-opting the furry fandom. Like you have people with no lives. That sit at the computer all day with nothing better to do. And cancel culture is not really about making people less racist. It's not about improving race relations. It's not about keeping people safe. The only thing cancel culture does is to make the person doing it feel good about themselves. You feel good about yourself because, oh, you took a bad person out. And that gives you some sort of value in your life. That, that makes you, give, gives you like a rush of dopamine for like two or three minutes. Like, I've been a furry. I know how it is. Like, these people are going to find validation in their life. Oh, look, we took down a racist or whatever. Even though, like, you're not really changing anything. Like, you're not, you're not making the world a better place. Just because you got someone fired doesn't mean they're going to change their views on the world. Like, that takes effort. You actually need to talk. I, I remember, like, there was this interview about a black guy who joined a KKK group and deconverted all of them. You know, and it was in the news and stuff like that. Yeah, that guy didn't get the KKK people fired. He actually had to stop and have a conversation with them. And it takes work. It takes effort. It's, it's not something easy. But, like, if you if you just get people fired for, like, having an opinion. I mean, this whole shit with J.K. Rowling is ridiculous. It's like the woman has an opinion. Okay, so fucking what? 
you know, I, I disagreed with feminism. I disagreed with her opinions on, on censoring people based on internet harassment or whatever the fuck. Kind of funny because now she's getting censored. But, like, the, the thing is, I disagree with her opinion, but I can still read her books. The fuck does one thing have to do with another? Oh, my God. It's, uh, it's really upsetting, you know, um... Because no one agrees with this. Like, I, I haven't found people that agree with the idea that, yes, we should fire everyone. And, and, and when you look at it, you notice that who's really profiting from it. I mean, <clears throat> take the guild method, which got me too. Who's profiting from it? Well, their competitors. You know, like when they say, oh, uh... The victim doesn't benefit at all. It's like, yeah, I, I've seen like over 20 girls on Twitch right now coming against different streamers. Some of them with genuine concerning stories. Others with stories that are absolutely ridiculous. And all of them get famous after they make their statement. Like they, they gain massive viewership. They gain massive followers. Like the thing of getting viewerships means you get more sponsors means you can get you you can ask sponsors for better deals they of course they're getting something people on the autism spectrum genuinely can't cope with anyone disagreeing with them i don't know about that but i i you know like a lot of furries from my personal experience when i was in the fandom a lot of people that i know they they would go on twitter and they would put up the fact that they have autism, like they would actually state that they have autism on their Twitter bio, you know, like no one. And now I don't know if they did it because it's like victim box and it was like popular to have a mental illness at the time. Because it's like, oh my God, oh, you have a mental illness. Oh, you poor thing, you. Oh, we must be extra careful not to upset you. And, and you know, like people treated them differently. So a lot of people, instead of putting pronouns in the bio, would put like, oh, I got whatever mental illnesses they had, you know, like, well, they claim they had. Um, whether it was autism, PTSD, uh, ADHD, like anything, you know, like you, you would find the person which had like a massive bio, usually like six or seven lines of bio there. But anyway, like let's, let's play the game. Uh, if boobs are not enough, she will like to gain power. Uh, I should focus on the game and, uh, you know... <clears throat> A lot of people ask me for like some more political live streams. Man, I'll, I'll I'll do some more political live streams, but right now it's it's very difficult. You know, everyone is getting cancel culture. And and it's it's really It's really demoralizing in a way, but how long can this shit last? I mean, they're going to run out of people if they keep doing it. Like, fucking Evo is getting cancelled now. The entire event. I mean, how much money was lost now because they had to cancel an entire event, like an entire fighting game event over the fact that the, the owner is a moron. Yeah, the infecting guy, uh, infected in this game are actually very strong. Um. I don't know, man. Like, here's the thing. You know, all the companies now, they virtue signal. And, and, and people call it the silent majority. 
I mean, the silent majority isn't going to cancel culture or fight back, but you know what they do? They're not going to purchase and support shit. And I noticed it's like a, a lot of companies now, you know, like the go old, go broke thing is, is kind of a rule. And, and it's because a lot of people just don't agree with these business practices. They know the companies are full of shit. Like they know the companies, they say, oh, we stand against racismus, but they do business with China and whatnot. And it's like, okay, so you're full of shit. <clears throat> I mean, look at McDonald's, you know, there's... There's pictures on Twitter from a Chinese McDonald's, uh, which doesn't allow black people in. And in the West, McDonald's is having, like, black people that are Marxist to, to have, like, a conversation on their Twitter. And it's like, well, why should I believe you? I think you're just for communism. Like the moment communism will come in the West, maybe you're you're going to do exactly what you're doing in uh, in China. I'm fine. Guys, get in here. The girl. It's a girl. That wasn't my point actually, it was Sarka. I get it once I die, lol. My god, the infected are really, really strong here. I generally feel like panic when, when I'm fighting them. Going to let the NPCs handle them. How many are they? Abby could have taken all of them. Abby would have taken all of them by now. This is a really good tactic. Ah, oh, shit. Is YouTube hemorrhaging money? Like, I heard they actually make a lot of money on ad revenue so Help! I wouldn't know <laughs> shit it's kind of difficult to do because I don't have any health left I don't have any bullets um, I guess I can just stay in this room and wait for them to come one by one and hope they they don't come two at a time Let me try standing even further back. Yeah, they come two at once and then I'm fucked. I have no idea what to do, like... No weapons, no ammo... Uh, is there a way to run- Oh, shit! A bottle! Okay. 
Well, a bottle is good. Ah, oh, shit. I don't think I can run. Uh, I mean, I could try, but I think, like, this is a, um... This is an arena encounter. Um, and you don't even have... Um, no. No. Don't even have like a dodge mechanic or something. Oh shit, I found the brick. I lost the brick. Yeah, I think maybe this is what I need to do, just run around. Um, I pick up shit. Wow, is she going to die? I mean, she got herself out the last time. Ah. She got herself out uh, by herself the last time, so that's why I didn't think she would die now. Oh my god. Well, time to help her. Ah! I couldn't even reach. Um, I don't think I sh I, I mean normally you'd have more health than I have so that's the main problem um, if I get hit once I'm dead is there one after me Oh, come on. Well, I think this is better. Fuck! Yeah, I hit and run, I guess. But the problem is, like, if it's one zombie, it's fine. If there's two, I'm dead. And the problem is like you're stuck in animation, so it's very difficult to get off me. Where's the bricks? I got the bricks. I need to just try and pick them one at a time. Oh, there's more coming in. Fuck! I thought it's like, oh wow, I'm going to survive this. And then I noticed, oh, two more come in. I wish I could reload from a, a previous point so I come here with more health. Like, that's the, the main issue. Like, I don't have health. Um, and I don't have bullets either. Nah. Yeah, Abby would have ptfo these people, no problem. Oh 
my god, get out of here, they're going to bring more in. There we go. Meh. <sighs> oh, hey Billy, how's it going? What? I thought he was stunned. This is so weird. Let me go. Hey, let a woman go. <laughs> God, I can't help her in the beginning, I think. I need to run away and pick them uh, up. But then I risk not making it back in time. Uh, it's not too hard, it's just unfair. I mean, one hit you're dead, you got no bullets, and there's just too many of them. Look, the moment you're surrounded, the moment, no, sorry, not you're surrounded, the moment you get two of them, you're dead. So I need to find uh, a way to constantly fight one of them at a time. Beer bottles help, but meh. They don't seem like a guarantee. Oh shit. More spawn. Come on, handle them. Handle it! More dots, more dots. Up. Is there another one? There's no more bricks, there's no more bottles. If I risk an engagement with one, I can die. Oh shit, there's two of them here. Ah, oh, there's a brick here. Where? Oh. I think there's a bottle. How many of them are there? Jesus! Wasn't there a bottle here? Where did it go? If I get killed now, I'm going to rage. Jesus! This was really ridiculously hard. I don't think you could have run, you you had to fight them. Oh, here we go. I mean that was more of luck than getting good. It it was all about managing to cars. avoid two there zombies at a time. That's our building. I believe the graphics for this game are still good. Alright. 
Now watch your step as you're going up, because it's going to be a little... Hello? Oof. What if that thing breaks? How do they know it's got structural integrity? So is that everything you hoped for? Jury's still out. But man, can't deny that view. Come on, this way. <coughs> hey, let's pick it up. How do you like the game, Billy? Look, we're almost done. Stay focused. Yes, ma'am. I love how he's not asking her, like, where you've been? Are you okay? That must have been some hard morning wood, yeah. <laughs> Women big bosses, says Kubus. Let's keep moving, kid. Notice how literally every building in this game has zombies in it. And it gives you like a sense of danger. I mean, you can't really relax. Even now, I'm like, oh shit, if there's more infected, I don't have help. Oh, hey, Sarah. It is a good game. Time to take uh, Antifa's favorite plaything. By the way, Sarah, this game was made by a woman. How do you like? <laughs> there we go. Home stretch, Tess. Um, just so it's out there, I can't swim. Look, it looks like it's shallow on the right side. Follow me. I'm glad Marlene hired you guys. What do you mean? I know you guys are getting paid for this, but... Um, trying to save things. Yeah, sure thing. I don't know how to swim, Billy. There's many people no. who don't know how to swim. No, <coughs> no, no. What happens now? What doing, Neil did not make this game. Maybe they, uh, maybe they had a map or uh, something to tell us where they were going. How far are we gonna take as this? As far as it needs to go. Where was this lab of theirs? She never said. She only mentioned that it was someplace out west. What are we doing here? This is not us. There There's even no sperm us. that can't swim. About me. I know that you are smarter than this. Really? Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess! I think she got bitten. That's why she's acting like this. Now we tried. <coughs> Let's just go home. I'm not... I'm not going anywhere. This is my last stop. What? Our luck had to run out sooner or later. You going on... No, don't! Don't touch me. Yeah, I think oh, she's shit. bitten. She's infected. <laughs> Joel. Let me see. Show it to me. Oh, Christ. Oh. Oops, right? Give me your arm. This was three weeks. I was bitten an hour ago, and it's already worse. This is fucking real, Joel. You've got to get this girl to Tommy's. He used to run Whoa, with this girl Tommy, no Tommy. No, 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 that was your crusade. I am not doing that. Yes, you are. Look. <coughs> I hear that you have to feel some sort of obligation to me, so you get her to Tommy's. Oh, 
They're here. Damn it. I can buy you some time, but you have to run. You want us to just leave you here? Yes. There is no way that... I will not turn into one of those things. Come on. Make this easy for me. I genuinely like this. No, no, just go! Just fucking go. Ellie. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't mean for this. Get a move on. Ellie, the home wrecker. Your <laughs> last shag. Stop. You stay close to me. We have to move. Oh, man. Yeah, this this game is actually having real, you know, the, the simulating real humans having real conversations. You know, relatable stuff. We'll go upstairs. We'll probably get out from there. Just keep pushing forward. I think she's dead. Took out two of my men. Oh Got my God. Out. You Tess. take out the door. You with me. Yes, sir. They're gonna be here soon. Oh, nice. What do we do? Joel? I got this. I love how she's loud and they're actually here. My god, I remember I died a lot at this point. Police brutality. I think they're soldiers, though. Can't uh, use a med kit. If I get shot once or hit once, I die. Oh, <laughs> 
Wow. Oh, come on! Why can't he dodge? <laughs> Why can't he dodge and I cannot? Such lame a thing. He can't breathe, Joel. He can't breathe. I don't think there are pipes in this game, though. Where are you, goddamn? Don't oh, come on. That's it. Man, I'm good. I'm like Rambo. I'm the predator. I'm Batman. The fights get to feel so intense as well. <coughs> Stay down. I don't know how many more there are. I'm Batman Billy. Of course you die multiple times. It's the hardest difficulty. You're supposed to die multiple times. Up, 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 up. Oh, there's three of them. Jesus. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, police brutality! Oh shit! Oh my god, that's going to appear on CNN, isn't it? I'm going over this way. What do you mean Batman doesn't tell you he's Batman? Wait, 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 wait! Oh my god, it... It starts from here? Wow! Man, the autosaves are so bad. Whoa. I have to do all of this shit again. Stop resisting. Stop resisting. I told you to stop resisting. You wouldn't stop resisting. Not my fault. Really? He didn't notice his friend there? Stay with me, come on. Hmm. Well, I guess the first part easy. Now that I know what to do. Where, where did I go down the stairs? <coughs> I got a brick, man. I'm gonna build shit. Ha <laughs> ha shit. Wow, this is going to be difficult. 
Switch out here. Don't check over there. I forgot how hard this game was on the last level. I also love Ellie going, holy shit. How? Why did they interrupt my combo? Come on. Only two of them come to me. Yeah, I know that that was weird. <coughs> I think it's because I hit the environmental object and it made sound. Keep your head down. Police brutality, police brutality. What Ashrak Gun said. I'm not the one resisting, he is. I don't want to lower the difficulty, where's the challenge then? Now the only question remains, where's the other soldiers? And which way to the exit? Oh shit, the super chat. Try take advantage of human shields, you can shoot at an enemy while you got one capture. They'll temporarily sh stop shooting. Yeah I know, but I don't have bullets. Um, I'm going to blame the super chat for this now. It's uh, Paul Butler's fault. Yeah, if you lower the difficulty, the game becomes really easy. I mean, even even one difficulty underneath this is making the game way too easy. All right. No, that's another game you're thinking. You can point a gun at them, but... You move very slowly, and it's just not worth it. See if I can get another one into the love room. Doesn't seem like anyone's coming. And it's just that guy. Oh, come on! Dude, when you hit someone with the brick, they're getting stunned. Why did this guy not get stunned? Very, very annoying. Go check over there. I'll just shoot him next time. Holy shit. Um, you don't get the sixth test thing in The Last of Us one. I don't think you can sneak past that one. He's literally in the middle of the room, guarding the exit. <clears throat> okay. Oh, 
Oh, there's another soldier over there. Hold on. I saw him. I think there's just one guy left. Go, come on. Stay with me, come on. I think there's either one or two left. Guys in here? Whatever. To the rear exit. How the fuck do they know? <laughs> Stay down. I don't know how many more there are. Can I still not make a med kit? Oh. Jesus, there's so many of them. There's like five or six left. Holy shit. Man, the tension is so great. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you can sneak Report. past them. Hold your positions. But I don't know their patrol route, so. Let's keep looking. Oh shit. There's two gentlemen in there. Just one hit. Why can't I have more health for this shit? Jesus. One mistake and it's back from the beginning. Really? I fucked up. I did one mistake. Give me another chance. Wah. No, but seriously, it's it's really infuriating. At least now I know how to get past this part really fast. Not to mention, like, I didn't want to shoot him with the gun, I wanted to shoot him with the shotgun. That would have killed him. Oh, come on, Joe. <laughs> well, blame the game, Sada, blame the game. Yeah, it is a shotgun. Wasn't there... Someone here?
Come on. I'm tired of this police brutality. They need to demonetize the police. The time. Right. Right, come on, it's like on YouTube, you know. Sarah, are any of your videos monetized just out of curiosity? <laughs> By the way, Count Dankula got remonetized. For those of you who didn't know. What? I got more bullets for the shotgun? Whoa. Have another brick. Uh, stealth is the best in this game. You need to get better sneaking them. Use listen more often. The uh, the last difficulty doesn't have listen. Fuck Why the fuck does he get on the table? Who does that? Who gets on the table? <laughs> Why did he get on the table? <laughs> that is so... <laughs> Just what the fuck is wrong with this? Oh my god. <laughs> Chad officer versus Virgin Joel. Getting on the fucking table. But seriously, like what SWAT officer would go in a room and the first thing he does is get on the table? <clears throat> Unreal. <laughs> I think I should get those uh, other shotgun shells first. Here we go. Stay with me, come on. What? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ha! Ah. <laughs> That's the way. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> Bitch! Yeah, Last brick. In some situations, you don't need to kill the enemy. I know you don't need to kill the enemies, but like, I can't hide from these people. I'm doing my best. My best is good enough. If he gets on the table again, I will fucking murder him myself. Yeah, he gets on the table. Okay, fine. Got on the fucking table. Why not? Ha! Shit! <laughs> maybe, maybe the auto save. Maybe the auto save. Huh? 
Will, will the autosave save me? Will the autosave save me? Of course not. Fucking autosave. <laughs> Why would the autosave save me? It's just a ghost. A spooky fucking ghost. Keep your head down. Ow. Ow. <laughs> okay, I figured out a save is not the way. Yeah, what if I just run for it? What happens? Let's see. I mean, I know the way now, so. Stay with me, come on. Keep your head down. Yeah, this is what happens if you run. <coughs> okay, running just isn't an option. Check out this area. Search down there. Where's the... Where's the second guy? There's supposed to be another cop. This is death chat. Ah, here's the second cop. Why on earth did he get off his uh, patrol path? See if I can take him out with one bullet. I don't want to waste a bullet on this. Not to mention the rifle is noisy. See if now I can make the run for it. Bro, it's a shotgun. It spreads. I heard one of them was a kid. Doesn't matter. They took out a bunch of our guys. Joel, there's the exit. Right. After today, I see it. Little firefly bullshit. Oh my fucking god, I'm doing this. South clear. North clear. Whoo! There's over there. Stay low. I can't believe I did it. Oh my god, it feels so good. Following us. What? How the fuck did they know? Jesus. Did they know? Shouldn't shouldn't I put the gas mask on? I repeat, no There's a soldier over there. When did he put his mask on? Copy that. How the hell are you breathing in this stuff? I wasn't lying to you. Did you spot him? No. Place is empty. I'll check out this area. Check down there. I didn't get to see when he put his mask on, but I assume he did.
<laughs> yeah, Joel, very calm, logical, did not very hysterical, exactly. Even Ellie, I mean, yeah, she's smart mouthed and whatnot, but she's still calm. Do I think Sarah would have been cooler than Ellie? We're gonna find clickers now. Something out. Sarah would have shit her pants. Yeah, I mean I don't know. She was kind of calm under pressure. Uh, no, I I still like this game. I think I like this game more because of the sequel. Jesus, she scared me. Uh, the microphone is bad because it's a PlayStation default microphone. I can't use my computer microphone for this. Yeah, not you, uh, Sarah, the, the Sarah from the game. Oh, I can dive. And now it tells me that I can dive. Do you like zombie movies, Sarah? <laughs> Pretty women make you feel intimidated. No, I'm talking with Sarah from real life, if she likes uh, zombie movies. Hey look, it still works. There's a ladder. Maybe we can use that. Oh yeah, I remember this. This is really cool. Well, uh, Sarah, it's the apocalypse and this kid has a cure and you have to take her to Seattle in order for a doctor to make a cure a vaccine get on really Ellie. okay okay be careful i got it. Well, a cure for the zombie virus. Why would they be schizophrenic? <coughs> hey, look, um, about Tess. I don't even know Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You don't bring up Tess. Ever. Matter of fact, we just keep our histories to ourselves. Ah, Secondly, base Joel. Don't tell anybody about your condition. <coughs> they think you're crazy, they'll try to kill you. 
And lastly, you do what I say, when I say it. We clear? Mansplaining to sure. her. Repeat it. <laughs> what you say goes. Good. Uh, now there's a town a few miles north of here. There's a fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. Distant Joel was awesome, yeah. Okay. Let's get a move on. Yeah, the voice acting is amazing. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it'll be faster to go through here. Man. What? <coughs> Nothing. It's just. I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked in the woods. Oh, it's look, a cool. crane. Even the graphics are amazing. Why don't you just take me back to Marlene? If she was up to the task, why'd she drop you off on us? Well, maybe she's better now. Hmm. Kid, I don't mean to upset you, but your friend's chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. She's a lot tougher than you think. It don't matter. Because <coughs> I doubt I can get either one of us back into the city in one piece. Trust me. I wish there were some other option. What's this? Hmm. Some hormone therapy. Here we go. Wait, this is the place where I came from, isn't it? Oh my god. Did I run around in circles? No, I don't think I ran around in circles. Hmm. I have no idea where to go. Oh, I came from here. Yeah. You know what's annoying? Like he he just won't run um, when he's out of combat. Oh yeah, there was uh, a landmark, a water tower. Um, here we go. It's kind of weird that this is here, like, makes you think you can enter it or something. <coughs> Abby didn't even exist in this game. Ah, here we go. Stacco. Should we climb it? <laughs> no. Wire on the top of it. We gotta find a way to go around. So what if there's wire on the top of it? I mean, if you got jeans, it should protect you a little bit, right? <laughs> you get up here, I'll get a look. What the fuck was that? Ah, oh, here we go. The crack pipe. A pipe with a pair of scissors attached. Yikes. Oh, you can even craft melee weapons in this game. I forgot about that. Can I use this to open the lock? Uh, I guess not. <coughs> Maybe I can use it to break a window. 
Uh, no what window. About what about what? Oh, yeah, that's what that. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, it is a waste of scissors. Um, I guess it's more difficult for someone to grab the pipe as you swing at them. Okay, Down going here. to the city. Just watch your step. It's a good drop. Look how many infected there are in this game compared to The Last of Us 2. The city feels actually dangerous. this? Guess not. <clears throat> what the fuck is she doing? I'm trying to learn how to whistle. The fuck? Down there is not the correct way. No. No. How the fuck did she manage to? Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. What this thing came out from inside here? <coughs> ah, here we go. Or no, actually I came down from here. Damn it! Why does this have to be so complicated? Can it be like an easy path? What? Ellie, what are you doing? Pretty sure it's somewhere here, but mm. maybe if I can get access to the roof. I don't think you can talk to her. So you come up, and you got this door on the left, and that's it. Okay. Well, we already talked about Mr. Anti-Bully getting bullied. Um, hmm. Man, I'm stumped. Oh, now I see. 
It's a full ship. gonna like yeah that is nice oh, shit it's jammed from the other side <laughs> Aren't you sure that? huh that's a good idea no that's not such a good idea <coughs> no it is a good idea you up how else are we gonna open it All right. Give me your foot. Uh, now just open it. Nothing else. Sure Maybe thing. she runs away now. Careful. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Ta da! Yeah. Good job. Thank you. Wait, which way now? The water tower? So let's see we get a car from this buddy of yours. <coughs> then what? Well, then we go find Tommy. Marlene said he's your brother? And more important, he was a firefly. He'd know where to take you. Oh, okay. He lives far from here, which is why we need the car. <laughs> yeah, this alley is actually likable, I agree. That's Bill's handiwork. Anybody else live in this town? As far as I know, it's just him. <laughs> what, one single guy in an entire town? <laughs> People are like, look how cute and adorable Ellie used to be. Whoa. Jesus! Whoa, Nelly! What the hell was that? That... Would be one of Bill's traps. Your friend a bit paranoid, maybe? No, that's putting it lightly. What's the deal with this guy? Well, he helped us smuggle stuff into the cities. He knows how to find things. Well, let's hope we don't blow up trying to find him. Just watch your step, you'll be fine. I don't think he's paranoid. I mean, if they really are out to get you. And not to mention, like, it's it's the apocalypse. He's putting traps for zombies. So, like. <clears throat> but, like, imagine the fact that in this game, in order for someone to have, like, a normal house, he has to put all these traps. And then you think about The Last of Us 2 with that farm. And they have just no traps, it's just they're living on a farm and nothing else, it's so weird. <coughs> it would be cool if you had a shotgun that... Um... How about we just leave this kind of stuff to me? Well, we could both be armed, cover each other. I don't think so. It would Open be cool, yeah. Alright. Probably could have a little bow. Oh, never mind. I don't want to do. Oh shit! <laughs> Fuck! I didn't. Come on! Ah! Justice for Abby. Not like when you think about it, there's there's really nothing bad that happened to Abby really. I mean she got what she wanted. She didn't seem to be traumatized over the loss of her friends. And the only thing that she had is like a dead dog, that's it. Let me use that. I'm a pretty good shot with that thing. How about we just leave this kind of stuff to me? Well, we could both be armed. Cover each other. I don't think so. Okay, now I need to pick this up. Here. Use this. Come. 
Yeah, she lost the vegan gains. So clear. Towards the end. All right. Imagine people complaining that this game had many cutscenes. It's like, what the hell were they talking about? Do I still have a thing? Okay, I have a thing. Well, that solves that. Now See, when sh Bill ain't exactly the most stable of individuals. <laughs> so when we get there, you let me do the talking. You understand? I understand. You got to be clear on this. He, he don't take too kindly to strangers. All right. Oh. See that wire? Stay underneath it, okay? Just keep your head low, and you'll be fine. All right. Nothing in here. You hear that? Yeah. Why would the Republicans want to say that Biden is not fit to run? I mean, they want to run against an incompetent person. Isn't there someone banging in here? You're gonna go in there? I wanna see what we can find. You're gonna find my body when I die from a heart attack. Don't worry. I got this. There's something in here. I was on private property, wasn't I? <clears throat> you think they ever found each other? How the hell would I know? Well, I'd like to think they did. <coughs> Aw. Okay, I think I got everything from here. Yeah, if Andrew Cuomo went against Trump, maybe they would have a chance, but like, I... No, seriously, if Biden manages to win... I mean, no, see, like, an entire political party electing a person that has... Let's get the hell out of here. ...dementia... <laughs> ...as the President of the United States. That would be the weirdest thing ever. I mean, really, like, an entire party, you couldn't find an, another guy. Like, was Pete Buttigieg not good enough? All right, stand back. All right. What the? F oh shit! Those things are kind of awesome. There's one way to do it. See that? Get back. Can I not jump over it? Oh, never mind. Just break. Just stay close. Oh, come on. 
What the fuck? <laughs> I got you. Damn it, Bill. Lol. What just happened? This is so cool. Another one of Bill's stupid traps. Can you cut it? There. That fringe, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. Wouldn't that pull him up? Cut that rope and it'll bring me down. On it. What if there's a zombie that heard the noise? This is so weird. Joel. Shit, here they come. Here. Catch. This is so cool. Just pin to the rope. Chat. Give this now. I got you. Damn it, Bill. Did that count to keep this? You sure. What just happened. Another one of Bill's stupid traps. Yeah, he, the the aim would definitely be thrown off. There. That but to be honest, like, like the the range isn't that big. I mean, like you're shooting from what five, ten meters. Cut that rope, and it'll bring me down. On it. Why is it taking so long for her to cut it? Joel. <coughs> Shit! Here they come. Here's the ammo. What? Where did they come from? Oh, and I have to watch all of this again. I got you. Damn it, Bill. Why can't you shoot the rope? <laughs> what just happened? Another one of Bill's. Fatal restart encounter, blah blah blah. I'm still Stupid hopeful. Stupid traps. There. That fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. Well, she's 14, so. Where did that guy that come from, though? And it'll bring me down. On it. Joel. Shit, here they come. Oh man. Man, it, and it does throw your aim off, to be honest. <sighs> Lucky I have chat. I got you. Damn it, Bill. What just happened? Another one of Bill's stupid traps. <clears throat> there, that fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. Cut that rope, and it'll bring me down. On it. Joel. Shit, here they come. This is incredibly difficult. It would be a lot easier if I had a mouse and keyboard and could flip my monitor so I can see this properly. Come on. I got you. Damn it, Bill. Uh, I think there is what a PC happened? version of this. 
I don't want to build stupid traps. No, I think I'm not sure if it's still PlayStation exclusive. There. <laughs> yeah, I should flip my monitor, way. yes. Okay. Cut that rope and it'll bring me down. On it. My gosh, she's cutting that rope like a ten-year-old girl. Like someone Shit, already said. Here, catch! Why? Why, Joel? I told you to reload. He only put one bullet in the chamber and then went like, up. Oh, now it's fully reloaded. I don't have a UI, Joel. I can't see how many bullets are in the chamber. I got you. Damn it, Bill. What just happened? I don't want to build stupid traps. I don't know if there's an emulator for this game, though. There. That fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. <clears throat> Why can't he just shoot the rope? Cut that rope, and it'll bring me down. On it! Joel! Shit, here they come. Reload. He won't reload it. Just hand to the rope. Ellie, that's yeah, he he won't reload it unless the, the gun is empty. Yeah, you get infinite ammo, but you can't reload. I mean, he, he needs to fire all six shots and then he reloads. Oh god. No, you can't shoot the rope. What just happened? I don't want to build stupid traps. There, that fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. Yeah, I think I need to shoot all first. And it'll bring me down. On it. Well, reloading a gun while standing upside down. I guess it would be very difficult, wouldn't it? Joel. Shit, here they come. Here's the ammo. No, no, he is reloading. Okay. Meh. I'd rather play with the soldiers. Like, the, the most annoying part is the beginning, where you have to watch this cutscene over and over again. Rage quit. Billy, you don't even play games. You don't know what a rage quit is. <coughs> I don't want to build stupid traps. There, that fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. Now I'm I'm playing two hours and then I'm probably doing some political live streaming. Bring me down. On it. Joel. Shit, here they come. Yeah, he's not reloading now. Just hand to the rope. Have to look it. Well, this is a flick 
record is low. Why did she have ammo though? Damn it. Come on. It's not Hurry, Hurry. Let's go me. Oh, it's a lot easier at least. Stand the fuck still, you're immune. Jesus. <sighs> what the hell? Running? Okay. I like running. Bill, beat the FOI, got clicker. Oh, shit, you took my frag, Bill. Turn around All right. and get on your knees. Don't test me. Just take it easy. Any fights? No. Anything sprouting? Oh, God damn it, I'm clean. If I see so much as a truck. Ow! <laughs> Stop! Son of a bitch! Are you done? Am I done? You come into my house. You set off all my traps. <laughs> you damn near break my shooting arm. Who the fuck is this punk and what's she doing here? I am none of your goddamn business and we're here because you owe Joel some favors. And oh. You can start by taking these off. I owe Joel some favors, some kind of joke. I'll cut to the chase. I need a car. Well, huh? it is a joke. Joel needs a car. <laughs> well, if I had one that works, <coughs> I sure as hell don't. What makes you think I'd just give it to you? Huh? Yeah, sure, Joel. Go ahead. Take my car. Take all my food, too, while you're at it. By the looks of it, you could lose some of that food. <laughs> Listen to me, you little shit. No, fuck you. You hate I need you to shut up. All right? Whatever favors you think I owe you ain't worth that much. Actually, Bill, they are. Well, it don't matter because I don't have a car that works. But there is one in this town. Parts. There are parts in this town. Meaning that you could fix one up. All right, I'm gonna do this. 
There's some gear I'm gonna need. <coughs> All right. It's on the other side of town. Now you help me go gather it, and maybe I can put something together that runs. But after this, I owe you nothing. That's fine. A couple of days from now, we'll probably be dead anyway. Yeah, but none of the cars Good. worked, so. Follow me. Oh, goddamn town's booby trap. Best stay right on my ass. Can't miss it. Knock it off. <laughs> Bill is great. All right. Whatever supplies you may want or need, I suggest you grab them. Wow, he's letting me take his shit. Does he even have shit that's worth taking? Could use a med kit. Was Bill even in The Last of Us 2? I don't even call seeing him. Look at Bill lying to me. It's like, oh yeah, if you need supplies, grab them. It's like, Bill, there are no supplies here. Found everything you need. We're good. Alright, Ellie, come on. Don't leave the door open. I got oh. it. We have to cross to the other building. Up the stairs. Let's move it. Just stay with me. Can't believe you agreed to this bullshit, Bill. What you should have done. Don't leave. I don't think I can go back now. Yeah, he's one of a kind. Yeah, Ellie is meant to build. Up here. Nothing in there that I need. Go ahead, take whatever you want. Thanks. My god, crafting stuff is so difficult in this game, you barely get anything. What kind of trouble are you in? Where the hell's Ted? It's just a job. S simple drop off. And what are you delivering? <laughs> <laughs> that little brat. Haha, <coughs> fuck you too. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You know, I, I hope you know what you're doing. You kidding me with this guy? So where are we going, Bill? Oh. My other safe house. <laughs> More of an armory. Wait, I thought we were gonna fix up a car. <laughs> we? You know how to fix the Bill. Just <laughs> like I said. <coughs> We're gonna need more guns. Oh. Is he going to give me a pistola? What if you're actually smuggling her for Epstein like someone in the chat suggested? Shh, shh, shh. Come inside. Oh, I've been to take care of that. Relax, it's nothing. So, you didn't answer my question about Ted. Yeah, I thought the two of you were inseparable. She's busy. Huh. Yeah, sure. Busy. Lol. Sounds to me <laughs> like might be trouble in paradise. Yeah, so much there. This is Bill. Why don't you fix one of these cars? Oh my god, you're a genius. I mean, the whole <laughs> time, why on earth had I thought about fixing one of these cars? Okay, don't be a dick. Their tires are rotted and... Damn it! Wow, Ellie actually throws bricks in this game?
Holy shit, it's not a shotgun. Billy was right. All right. You gotta check very <coughs> again. You neglect the simple shit and now you're paying for it. You know what that means? Taking all the supplies from the warehouse okay. and into the east now he's to again. Then it'll take Bill, you. Joel, <laughs> this way. Was there ammo on the ground? I think I got it. I mean, if there's ammo on the ground, I'm definitely not seeing it. No, I got, I got all of it. There is no ammo on the ground. Why, why did you lie to me? Oh, this one? This is a bottle. You picked a hell of a place to hold up, didn't you? You know, as bad as those things are, at least they're predictable. The normal people would scare me. You all people <coughs> don't understand that. What does that mean? Nothing. Are you hmm. sure that gate's gonna hold them? Well, I locked it. They don't have a key. So which way? We're here. It's in the cellar. Oh. Touch anything. And you close the door? Hmm. Of course, she's going to touch something, right? Let's gear up. Uh uh. What? I need a gun. No, you don't. Joel, I can handle myself. No. Just stay here. It's fine. Just wait around for you two to get me killed. Well, this goes on record as the worst <coughs> fucking job you've ever taken. Hey, it's up there. How in the hell is Tess okay with this suicide mission? It's actually her idea. Really? Well, the broad's not as smart as I thought she was. What? Fuck her. Huh? Seriously, you gotta take that kid back to where you found her. Well, I can't just take her back. Then send her packing, let her find her own way. Look, let me tell you a story. Huh? Once upon a time, I had somebody that I cared about. A partner. Somebody I had to look after. And in this world, that sort of shit's good for one thing. Getting you killed. So you know what I did? I wasn't the fuck up. And I realized it's gotta be just me. Bill, it ain't, it ain't like that. It's bullshit. It is just like that. <laughs> hey! What I said to you when we walked down the steps? What I say? I'm just fixing your stupid pile. Don't touch. God <laughs> damn it. You keep babysitting long enough and eventually it's gonna blow up in Bill. your face. Can we please just get on with it? Here. Let's get on with it. <laughs> Before we go any further, I got something I gotta show you. <laughs> yes, I see the shotgun, Bill. New toy from the toy box. <sighs> this is a nail bomb. You gotta be really careful. This thing blows, it shreds anybody standing nearby.
So we got shotguns and bombs. What the hell are we doing with them? Well, every few weeks, this military caravan rides through town. I assume they're out looking for supplies. I mean, you, you'd be amazed at the shit that they overlook. Anyway, a few months back, they were rolling through and they get overrun by this horde of infected. They were all over the truck. It plows right in the side of the high school. Still sitting there with a the battery in it. We take that battery and we put it in another car. Bingo! I wanted to get it, but it seemed too dangerous with all the infected on that part of town. But fuck it! Joel needs a car! It won't be <laughs> damaged. Yeah, those trucks are like tanks. Just sitting there. Actually, my work. You get two shotguns in this game, Billy. <laughs> Look, I got two shotguns, Billy. One. Two, see? They're two shotguns. <clears throat> Kid, I swear to God, if you took anything... Hey man, I don't need any of your shit. Trust me. Joel, you are keeping an eye on her, right? Like a mm. hawk. Will we shoot shotguns, Billy? Wow. Nice place you got here. Oh my god, the church. Can you imagine? Like back when video game designers weren't afraid of churches. Now, if you got anything to confess, this would be the place to do Yeah, but Billy, you don't know what a shotgun is. As you clearly demonstrated. Right. Time to sack up. <laughs> yeah, this is very oppressive. Ellie, come on. Look, there's a school. Ready? All right, we're going to school. Ready? Guess we'll find out. But I can't take guns to school. <laughs> Look, Billy, you, you don't know that these are different weapons, like you thought both of them are shotguns, but they're clearly not. I mean, I tried to lie to you to see if you know, but yeah, clearly you don't. Need to be looking at that. <laughs> I've seen worse. All right, then. Let's get a move. <clears throat> Past this gate, it's all new territory to me. I'm on it. Hey. hey. You guys hear that? Okay, to shut up a Ah. This gate, it's all new territory to me. I'm on it. Hey, hey, you guys hear that? Keep quiet. Thank you, Billy. That's a good shotgun, Billy. What the hell? Are there more? Oh crap. Aww. 
Wasn't that another brick or something here? Go. See, Bam. this is a rifle bit. I was too damn close. <sighs> Jesus, ah, oh, crap. <clears throat> I'll probably end the stream now. Yeah, uh, so I'll be playing tomorrow and I'll be live streaming some politics and. 10 or 15 minutes yeah, and on, I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the donations and see you in a bit.